Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Kaiser Reich. I'm your host, Mr. Italian Imperium Lover, but right now, as you can tell, we have a little bit of a conflict with that there uh, Reich's Pact Reno, the Russian German War, of course. We're not fighting the Entente, at least not yet. Wow. Wow. The Don Combat Union's done really well against the Russian Republic. But we're just kind of hanging out here, having a good old time, and pretty much open up a second front against the Germans, especially the Austrians and the Swiss and the French people, but. Hey, we'll see how we do. Hopefully we do well. Got some comms to go through as well. But we got the Green Shirts Brigade. The Green Shirts. Founded during the Civil War. Are formerly the uh, Militia Voluntaria per la Sicurezza Nacionale. The Voluntary Militia for National Security. Or MVSM for short. But are most often called by the informal name due to the distinctive Green Shirts. The Green Shirts are organized in a military fashion, modeled on the Arditi soldiers, which also extends to the uniforms, while they've been muscle for the A&I for some time. Now that we are at war, they've stepped up to defend the Republic from all enemies. Death to the enemies of Italy. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Oh. Three to be oh. Uh, I don't know about... Oh, there you go. Okay, thanks for switching around. Actually, you know what? Convert. There you go. Become motorized. Uh, we could do that, but we're not going to do that for now. Um, I did switch us immediately to War Economy, which would be pretty nice. Are we missing anything here? No, we're doing pretty darn well. We're building quite a few roads. We probably want to get some more civvies so we can build some more stuff. And maybe a little bit more uh, fuel, because we could probably really, really use more fuel, which would be very nice. Oh, yeah, they're still raiding us too, which sucks, but hey, we'll get there. We do have 71 ships, which is pretty decent, but let's see how well we do. As we'll slowly be trying to move into Austrian held, or I guess Reichspack held territory. Which, overall, we're doing quite well, I would say, in Switzerland, at least for now. Not perfect, of course. But we're doing decently enough, I would say. Because Russia is... They're, so, they're definitely holding out. They're definitely not out of the war just yet. They might be, be really bloodied and beaten, but... They're definitely holding out for now. We're struggling a little bit here, but... Actually, we're doing quite well in the Balkans, if anything. Quite well in the Balkans, actually. Very well in the Balkans. And we can get Baron picture these guys, that would be fet not met null. That would just capitulate the Swiss. Which would be a very good thing. Ooh, that is not a very good thing though. Ooh. Ooh. Okay then. Go and repair. Put us down there, that's fine. Go repair, go repair. Ooh, that's not good. Losing a lot of convoys, which does suck. But, we can grab some more of this, too. Nice. Oh. Oh, we didn't win there. Oh, we won in Baron, but we need Zerek as well. Oh, crap. That sucks. Maybe he's gone. That's fine. This should definitely help out the Russians. This should definitely help them out. Recon 3. Yeah, of course, it's 1943, of course. The Entente really wants an aggression pack, but I'm not feeling that yet. Radar effort. Let's see. So we're over here. I can't remember where it is or not, but radar is a promising new technology which, with further development, could provide a wealth of information about enemy tactics, and positions, and real courts of enemy aircraft, rule of skies. The Air Force is no longer a ragtag collection of volunteers, but a fully functioning organ of the military. That's rule of skies of Italy and beyond. Oh, good, we get zero. That'll be good. There you go. Nice. I want you all to hold and just like get on the line. Nice. Very good. He's still learning. I want him to become iron sides, which would be very good. Oh, they've oh they've the expect right there too. It's fine. Nice, not good destroyer. They're not really attacking us yet. Not yet, again at least for now. Help us out, help us out. Um, six more divisions are pretty good, actually. There you go. Rule Skies, followed up with... Maria Nazionale, Nazionale Italiana. Our Navy still organized the same impromptu prom structure was upon the outbreak of the Civil War. We should centralize our Navy administration under a new structure. Pretty much, man, pretty much. 43, of course. Grab some of the stew. That'd be good. Uh-oh. What have I over here? Out of planes. Look at a uh, convoy. That's fine. No, I don't want your non-aggression packs. Nice. Not bad. Oh, they're attacking us too, which is pretty good too. Uh, how strong is Vienna? Three million manpower. Wow. All don't serve. That's all the soldiers too. Ooh, we have one too many, huh? There you go. For now. The Russians. Oh, you know they're not doing terribly. 
They did, get, they did take out Trans and Moor, which is very good for them. But we will see, of course. Ooh, Ironside? Nice. This is what I was waiting for. Let's see, big gun expert, more ship attack. Chance to receive critical hits. Um. Uh, let's do that one. Chance to sustain. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do that. For now, it's fine, too. Ooh. Hopefully, we'll do some extra damage here. Definitely see, though. Oh, yep, yep, now they're definitely attacking us. Look at that. Well, hopefully, we can hold out. Especially in the mountains, we should be able to hold out. There should be zero issue with that. We're propaganda, because we can. Losses. German Empire. We're not even on the scoreboard for them. Austria, though, should be pretty flipping high. Yeah, look at that. 190,000 so far-ish. That's pretty darn decent, I'd say. Um, in the meantime, capitulate those guys. Should be able to at least capitulate those guys. Ooh. Ooh, that's not good. Why don't you do this? Protect the convoys. Oh, wow. Look at that. Just another... Oh. We have all this stuff maxed out, which is pretty nice. That's about Jean, eh? Oh. We lost an S. Guys, come on. Oh, there goes the Navy. Well, that's so stupid. They just sunk the entire Navy, pretty much. Of course, then these were pretty dreadnoughts. What do you expect? That was pretty bad. Where are planes? They are trying to attack pretty flipping hard, though. And it looks like we will definitely need more manpower, so I don't want to go to the service bar requiring, but we will. Don't want to, but we will have to. Alright, not bad. Plenty of radar over there and down here too. Oof. So bad. Decryption. Looking pretty decent overall. How many losses did they take from us? Nowhere near enough. Maybe some odd thousand. So what did to get do? Oh, we can picture those guys up there. Oh crap, it's gonna take forever. Supply wise, it's pretty bad up here, isn't it? Um I'm not sure what else we could do for supplies. Maybe do that. Some more of that too. Logistics wise, what are we on? Because I don't want too many supply issues. We're already on 1942 stuff, which is very good actually. We are missing some anti-air, which sucks. And, ooh, we're missing guns. So that's really not good. So, rule the skies. We're making some guns already. We're going to lose by quite a bit, actually. There you go. That should save quite a few guns. Yeah, there you go. Alright. There we do that one, too. Merchant Marine. So during the Valkyrie, the land became a graveyard for Allies' merchant ships. With, and with success in the next war, certain to be no less dependent upon the ability of merchant ships to traverse dangerous waters. We also have Central Merchant Shipping Administration to oversee convoys. Pretty much. God damn, they keep shooting down our planes. Of course. I did take Triple Otani out too, as well, so. These guys have a lot of strength. Three million map is nothing to laugh at. Um, they have a lot of guns, too. Yeah, I don't know. Russia is still holding out, though. Um, they, uh, uh, we have quite a bit of compliance here. Quite a bit of compliance, unfortunately. I definitely see. Wow. Yeah, you're definitely not allowed to lose here. They must have a really strong air superiority. That must be it. Yeah. We need more factories on everything here.
just tons and tons and tons and tons of divisions that is what they have. Why is supply so bad? These guys are only 27 combo with each. Valkyrie Gira, pre dreadnought, yeah, that'll suck. There's a modern heavy, that's good. Um, do we have the armor for it though? No, we don't. God dang it. Secondary turrets, it's fine. Just don't lose a lot of the connection here. They should be taking way more losses than this. Way, 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 way more. Oh, that's not looking good to either here. Keep building, keep building, keep building, keep building. Is there any place where they do not have supply connection? No, they all have supply connection here. Yeah, so we'll spend a lot more time doing this. After this one, Merchant Marine expands the Samarca Brigade. To wage war upon foreign shores or to land behind enemy lines and disrupt their organization, we we'll need to invest in new amphibious equipment and training methods. Reinforce the coast. The only coast of the Adriatic is their lifeline of the markets of the world, and thus cannot be allowed to fall in enemy hands. We should construct new coastal fortifications so that no enemy shall land upon these shores. You know, battle cruisers, uh, Italian Coast Guard, destroyers, battle cruisers, Grand Navy. Black cruisers and destroyers. I'll probably go this one. Defend the coast. The new navy should be oriented towards protection of our coast and disruption of enemy merchant fleets. Italian Coast Guard. A new branch of the navy should be created which is focused on the protection of our territorial waters. Italian battleships? Battleships are the pride of any navy. Large, well armored, and armed, they are expensive to produce. New battleships entering our naval service will undoubtedly signal to the world that we seek to regain a place in the world. Italian subs. Subs are used to great effect by Germany and the Valkyrie. We must have a sub fleet of our own if our navies be effective. Black cruisers. Black cruisers are versatile support platforms which can greatly assist ships both large and small. Rule of seas. Our navy is now at least a match for the old regime marina. And fully prepared to defend Italy and crash upon our enemies like a great wave, which would be a great thing to do. And here we are, everyone. The fall of Berlin. Of course, reports from Berlin confirm that the German city has been captured by advancing Italian troops after long merciless fighting through the greatest city of the Reich's pact. German force put up stiff resistance, hoping to delay the Italian force for as long as possible, but were eventually beaten back. As shocked, Berliners looked on, the Italian army paraded down the Brandenburg Gate before listening to a speech by Italo Balbo in front of the famous monument, but what eventually seems to have caught the attention and memory of the world is a picture of an Italian soldier proudly holding the Italian flag from the roof of a heavily damaged Reichstag taken by one of his squad mates. It's all over but for the German Empire now. And I, we already capitulated the, uh, Austro the United States of Greater Austria. And they lost a lot of guys. These guys in the German Empire have lost quite a few dudes as well. Um, they, 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 they definitely advanced further to Russia, but not really by much at all, as we're, well, at this point, just kind of marching through them, so. Could be doing better, of course, but overall could be a lot, 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 lot worse. Um, still kind of waiting for that stuff. Eh, hey, we got that one done, which is very nice. Come over here. And the collapse of the Reich's pack. Appears you don't think it was occurred? Pretty much. The Kaiser Reich is about to fall. Very nice. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, we got him. Oh, what'd you look at that? Alright, so let's divide it up slightly fairly. Australasia, Russia. Well, I don't think they deserve any of that stuff. You guys. Cuba, you guys need that stuff. It's fine. Um, where's Canada? You can have England. And you can have Cuba. And Haiti. I'll take the rest of everything else. Thank you. Oh, very nice. Fate of these guys, store Ordentensino. German Empire, at this point I'll probably just take them all anyways, it's fine with me. I don't think anyone else really deserves them too much. Yum yum yum, Germany's yummy. Store Ordentensino, why not? Uh, Upper Savoy and Trentino. Uh, store Trentino, of course. Trieste, Austrian Littoral, and all of them. Not bad. I guess we're peace now too. Look at that. Cannons up here. The UK is probably going to get released. Um, they canceled their aggression pack. Oh, they're still fighting these guys. Okay. Um, of course, right now we're doing the Stable Italian Republic too. 
Republics have been unstable since the end of the Civil War, but now with the Italian Republic ruling all over Italy, we can finally end this instability that's been plaguing our nation for years. Pretty much, pretty much. So that's pretty much the last focus. Recruit Sicilian generals, well, they're not alive. Recruit Sardinian generals, and we can't go to war with them too. I honestly don't really want to invade Sardinia. I really don't want to. I don't really care about them. We pretty much finished focus three. Um, yeah, we could go to war with the Entente. I honestly don't really feel like it. Invaded Germany. Our armies, our armies defeated the once proud Germany. We now have only decided what to do with their lands with the former enemy. Yeah. Thanks, Poland. Fate of Austria. Austria has been forced to capitulate, and our troops are pulled to the streets of Vienna to prevent a rebellion or anything that could cause further instability. However, simple post security a local Austrian government would be more helpful. Yeah. Fate of Switzerland. After fierce fighting in the Alpine Mountains, we finally conquered Switzerland. The Swiss army surrendered, and the territory is under control. What we should do with the lands that we now control it. Yeah, there goes the UK. Yeah. I'm not going to do a deal with all this stuff. Why do, was it, why do we get all those options? If we say we don't, we want to liberate them, we, or we want to keep them under us, we should have to get penalized even further down there. So, yeah, I'll do the French one, though. Paris has been captured, and the French have been defeated. We've ripped out the heart of the revolution, and we almost decided what to do with occupied France. There you go. Honestly, there should be a way just to demand that we get them. I mean, I don't think there's going to be very much here for us anyways, but... Of course, these guys are in the downtown as well, which does suck. Uh, still. Mm, it doesn't really matter at this point anymore. It doesn't really matter at all. The field marshal, yes, sir. I'm not, we're gonna deal with this stuff. Why do you get the fate of France again? Send in the army because you can. Cool. And there's one ship's gonna take forever. God dang it. There you go. Stay up Italian Republic. Stability in our Italy? Well, yeah, we'll see about that. Oh, can you guys go in? Oh, I gotta prepare. You know what? Screw it. You go, come here. Make it shorter for us. We're almost there. Somalia's gone? Oh, the Somalia, nice. Goodbye, Somalia. I should play as Ethiopia sometime. Oh, look at that. Oh, we're fighting them all now. Well, at the very least, let's try to naval invade. We'll see what happens. If it doesn't go well, then so be it. I don't really care. French Republic has been called in. Spain will be ours. Spain's just a lot of pain. I hate this sometimes so much. So dumb. At least we get all these guys, and these guys, and these guys, too. How much more command power do we need? Way too much. It's only, it's honestly like four more, but that's not bad, but still. How um, many are you going to be thrown in? There goes Belgium, that's nice. There you go. Oh, actually, that's nice. Good job, guys. Good. Bloody through there, which is great, 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 great. You guys stay there. Keep these guys on board. Cagliari, nice. Oh. Well, that's quite the naval battle. Oh, now the ships are coming in. Oh, we lost the destroyer. That sucks. Sunk six enemies destroyers, though. That's pretty good. Not bad. Go in. Seriously. Don't stop until they're all dead. Oh, we have more naval doctrine? Nice. Oh, mo even more? Nice.
Don't let him move. Kill them all off. Butcher them. And take out Spain and Portugal. Good. Hey, they capitulated. So can we do anything about Italy? At all? No? Short and Sutarol? Not quite. Oh, you guys are still struggling here too. That's fine. There you go. And we'll wait till these guys are gone. And then I think that should be it. Luxembourg Road, Sardinian legitimacy. Very nice, very nice. Oh, it's like a battleship too. Awesome. Ooh, lost the ship. Come on, let's at least get Spain. What the heck are you doing over here? Oh. Go ahead and retreat. And eh, we lost. No, we won. Eh, it could be worse. Nice. There we go. That's pretty much all I care about. I, I was wondering that we could do anything else here, but apparently there's nothing else here we could do. So let's do that, and yeah. Fall Gibraltar. Not bad, but if you enjoyed the campaign, that's pretty much going to be it for me. Subscribe if you're new. Uh, or leave a like. Or do all that stuff. Um, let me know what you thought this campaign was like. The challenge is doing really well. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.